I feel like I'm running so far <laughs> behind. It's uh, 11.30 about, yeah. It's just a little bit after 11.30. I just left Wally World. I had to get some more completes, some more mail completes um, because what we had wasn't gonna fit. Um, but yeah, I just finished going to Wally World. So I stopped to get gas. I went to Office Max to pick up my label maker. I printed out the flavor labels that go on the, where you press the button for your pop. Had to print those out, get them laminated, cut them, all of that good stuff. Had to do that, then I had to run to Wally World because I need one more tote for the rest of the items that I still have in the house. Um, it's just been a lot. Uh, I still have some gas. Um, but yeah, so. Whew, tired, I'm hot already. Um, I told the gentleman between 10 and 12, so he should be delivering the machines as we speak. But um, yeah, that's it, that's it, that's it. Here you go. So I'm done, it is now 12.20. Um, yeah, I'm on my way out there. It's going to take me about 20, 30 minutes to get there. Um, truck loaded up. This is so hard to do with one person, but babe had to work today. So had to do it on my own. Um, yeah, but got it done. So it's going to be a long couple of hours. Um, I assume, but that's cool because this is how it go. This is the hustle. So I'll see you when I get there and I'll show you what we got. I actually had to be really strategic here because I only had one dolly. So I had to make sure I unloaded my snacks first, then my drinks, especially because the drink machine wasn't there and the drinks were going to have to sit for a while. I'm here at the warehouse. He has the first machine. Nope, I just brought in the first load. Well, now you just put in the spot, but... This is my dry goods, chocolates and the cooler on ice. So one cool thing is there's a lady here that I met when I first walked in the door and she told me about what some of the people here like to drink. So that was super helpful. Let me clean my camera. But yeah, that was super helpful. So this here's all the drinks. The drink machine has not arrived yet. So I'm, I pulled that out last. I'm gonna leave that on there. Um, so I'm about to start loading the snacks right now. It's really important that you think of the supplies that you might need going into it. I brought a step ladder, some scissors, some tape, and things like that, just in case. Also, prepare your mind for loss because it can and will happen. Don't let it get you down. Just keep going. It's three o'clock. I have the first machine. I had to do a lot of rearranging to figure it out, but I figured it out. I'm about to fill it up with the money. Right now, I had to stop at the bank this morning. So, fill it up with some money. Keep it moving. The drink should be a whole lot quicker because you just load them in and go. So, it's 515. Highs and lows. Um, highs, I got to meet a lot of people that were here. Find out what they wanted specifically. Find out what people like. Um, for example, a lot of people told me that they like Monsters instead of Red Bull. Check. There was one gentleman here um, who happened to be my one of my main contacts. He said he wanted something diet. Okay. Um, so we'll see how that goes. Um, do not put square bottles in the machine. I think that's not a great idea I was looking at and I was like mm, the way that it turns might not be the best thing ever I didn't know that when you move your drink machine it has to sit for 24 hours before you can even turn it on I, I think it has something to do with like the Freon it has to settle so learn that my Nyx machine in the break room was not working like it was say processing it would not dispense the food um, because it just kept saying processing and there was this gear that just was perpetually turning so I don't think the Wi-Fi is strong 
in the warehouse and I chose Verizon so I don't know if it has something to do with that or how dense the walls are I'm not sure um, so I need a diet oh my Powerade bottles didn't fit they're too wide for the machine something I did not know or even consider um, yeah they're too wide for the vending machine um, I think it's possible to change the spacers a little bit, but I'm not sure at this moment. So that's something I have to figure out. I went to make my labels with the label maker, which I forgot at Office Max. Spent time to go back over there just to find out at the end when I was about to go make my price labels that um, there was no power cord in the box and it was the last one sitting on the shelf so someone took it and returned it um good thing is my snack machine is working and functioning it's completely full and it looks great um it does accept dollars and coins right now for some reason there's a exact change only error on the thing or Note, I figured out how to use the button so I can change it from saying welcome to like the Hampton Inn to now it says elite vending. Um, so that was cool. Took a while, figured that out. Um, yeah, this was a task. Um, but it's fun. I'm learning. I'm sure as I go along, it will become a whole lot easier. So that was day one. I have to come back out here tomorrow. We haven't even done contracts or anything like that. So yeah well that's that i'm out um yeah that's it for this video if you found value smash that like button like comment share subscribe tell a friend to tell a friend and i'll see you in the next video peace did you know i picked out a video just for you really i did i put it right here click it click it right now so you can check it out just for you.